You know, I was okay with filming this video outside until I realized how quiet my neighborhood is and I hate myself. Well, we've already started. Let's continue. Hey guys, it's Bree and welcome to my front yard. So in case you can't read or you clicked this video by mistake, which is probably why you're here, this is my October favorites video and yeah. Let's get into it. So first up on my October favorites is this Bethany Moda perfume. Now she has a new one, I know, I need to go grab it because I'm obsessed with this. Like, okay I got it like a year ago but still, like, I've been so obsessed with this the past like couple weeks of October and I just needed to put it in here because it's like all I've been wearing every single freaking day. Can you focus please? Okay. Homer. Next up are these Maybelline Color Blur by Lip Studio Lippies. I love them so much. I'm wearing one today. Uh, I think I'm wearing number 45, which is I'm blushing. So that's the one I'm wearing today. <laughs> Those people walking by are probably like, what the fuck is she doing? Why did I choose to film in my front yard? I don't know. You tell me, because I don't fucking know what I'm doing. I'm number 45 today, and the other ones I have are number 50, I like to mob it. Um, this one is more natural, so if you want like a natural nude-ish lip, then that's that. Um, this one, as you can see, is kind of more of a pinkish tone, but then it... Then again, it's, uh, it's a nice shade of pink. And then this one is bright as fuck, and it's 10 Fast and Fuchsia. The next lippy... Can you focus, please? Fuck. The next lippy I have for you is the NYX Jumbo Lip Pencil. This one is in 724 Chaos, and it just looks like so. It is a gorgeous pink. I love it so much. So yeah, if I'm not wearing the Maybelline by Lip Studio ones, I am wearing the NYX Jumbo Lip Pencil. I guess I should swatch the other ones for you. Bad YouTuber probs. This is the... This is number 50 from Maybelline Color Blur. And it is such a natural color, like compared to that one, as you can see. Um, and then this one is number 10. Fast and Fuchsia. See, I'm not really into these types of ones. I think there's teenagers walking by. I fucking hate myself. Oh, next up we have this unique Moodstruck Precision Brow Liner. This one's in dark and it is amazing. It has the uh, spoolie thing on the one side and then it has the product on the other. It has such a precise um, applicator like it's really thin and it's like really easy I sound like such a basic bitch right now I'm so sorry it's really easy to like get into your eye line eyebrows I need to shut up I have the spin brush uh, my life my shop spin brush this is the cleansing one I think and then there's a uh, there's the exfoliator piece that you like pop on and then there's one for like your body it's like it's like exactly like this but it's like huge I don't like that one the one for your body is kind of awkward like I'd rather just use my freaking loofah yeah, I got the pink one I got this on hot look or oat look or whatever you call it um, it was pretty cheap on there so that was awesome I just needed something to clean my face better because my hands were not doing the trick. And I'm a cheap ass bitch, so I look for deals. <laughs> my neighbors probably fucking hate me because I never stop swearing. Like, I swear to God, I haven't stopped swearing in the past like 20 minutes I've been out here. Sorry! <laughs> Next up, I have the uh, Ultra Repair Cream by First Aid Beauty Intense Hydration for Parched Skin, which is exactly what my skin is. So this, honestly, like this is the best moisturizer I have ever found, and I didn't even find it. It was sent to me by freaking Ipsy, but whatever. Um, yeah, it just looks like this, so this is like the sample size, and I freaking love this shit. 
so much. It makes my face like actually feel moisturized. Um, coming up in a products I regret buying video, you'll see a moisturizer that I didn't like so much, but I love that one. Next, I have this. Can I stop saying next? Like, I find that so annoying. Like, next, I have this product. Um, shut the fuck up. So, I was gonna say next. Like, I swear to fucking god, I was gonna say next. Anyways, I have this tea tree skin clearing facial wash, and this I've been using it for a while. As you can see, it's like almost out. Mom, help! I need new freaking face wash. Anyways, um, cause I'm poor as fuck. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's just this cute little like jar thing. And this actually works. It actually makes my face feel like cleansed and just feel really nice afterwards. So, um, yeah, and it helps clear my acne. I have Next up are these right here. These leggings. I love these things so much. They are from Garage. They are like white and grayish. I have black ones too, but these Garage leggings are my freaking life. This is literally all I've been wearing the past like... Actually, since like school started, <laughs> I have like one pair of jeans and they're not even jeans, they're jeggings. I live in leggings and garage leggings are what I freaking prefer. Oh my gosh, they're amazing. So yeah, shout out to you, garage. Once again, not sponsored, but I wish. Another item of clothing that is my favorite, I didn't say next, be proud of me guys, I'm fucking proud of myself, is this sweater from Pink. And it has like the dog on the front and then it says pink and leopard print and black here This is the comfiest sweater I've ever freaking owned. This was the last one in the store and it was my size like how How lucky can I get like really holy, but yeah, it doesn't have a hood This just kind of like scrunches up at your neck if that makes any sense But yeah, it's adorable and I love it. It's next I have this lip medex medex blizz Tex for cold sores, cracked, and dry lips. I got this from Dollarama for a cheap ass price. And it works really good. It like, it has that like medicated smell to it and when you put it on your lips, it just freaking burns. It actually works, which is amazing because I haven't been able to find a freaking lip balm that actually works for me in a long ass time. And I am so happy that this works for me. God bless. Next up for favorites, I have this Vanilla Bean Noel shower gel, hand lotion, or hand cream, and freaking fragrance mist. This shit is the absolute best. I freaking love it. I love this scent. I could like eat it. Like I could he eat my hand cream. Like I'm not even kidding. So I bought two shower gels because I love it so much and it was on sale. I bought hand cream on the sale once again. And this perfume now they didn't have the big kind so I had to get the little one and yep still love it though I'll probably buy like five of these this Christmas guys this is my cat his name is Homer shout out to you buddy <laughs> he's staring at the neighbor Every artist for this month is Front Porch Step. I absolutely love them. I love every single song. There's not a song that I've listened to yet that I have not liked. And I love it. And it's amazing. And yeah. Go listen to them right now. Oh. That's not something you want to see. Problems with using a flower pot as your tripod. Yep. Ratchet YouTuber probs. It's starting to rain. My favorite subscriber for this month, which is someone who is subscribed to me, is Shelby Quackworth. Girl, you've been giving me the love this month and I freaking appreciate it so much. You have no idea. That was a louder truck than I wanted it to be. She makes videos just like I do, so go check her out and subscribe and stuff. Anyways, guys, that's it for this month's favorites. Stay tuned for next month's favorites. While I will probably still be in this same place, but there will be snow everywhere. I hate winter. Bye guys, thanks for watching. As it literally starts to fucking pour. Awesome. Love my life. Wow, what a spooky background with two zombies behind me <laughs> and a cat. <laughs> I didn't know he was there. Hey Homer, how do you feel buddy? Well, nice talking to you. Bye.